Rolling down a backwoods Tennessee byway One arm on the wheel Holding my lover With the other That sweet, soft, southern thread I worked hard all week Woo! What's going on, everybody? Oh, I'll tie back at you again. And yes, I've gotten up here and I'm fixing to talk about this damn SEC matchup we got going on down there in Titletown, USA, baby. Six o'clock Bama time. We got the Masari, the Masari Truman cat piss smelling tigers coming on in to Brian Denny, baby. And it's going to be a, a good game. I'm looking forward to it. Uh, you know, everybody's always talking about. These two quarterbacks going at it, Tua and Locke. You know, Drew Locke, he's a good quarterback. Uh, but, you know, he's, he's still nothing compared to what Tua's done this year. Uh, they won't tell me, well, I'll tell you, he's about got as many passing yards as Tua. You know, he's got about 15 or almost 1,500 yards, and Tua's about got 1,500 yards. But Tua's done it in less attempts. He's, I think he's got like maybe 96 or 95 attempts less than what Locke's got this year. So I just show that just goes to show you what kind of season that uh, <laughs> that two is having this year. And uh, man, I just I just continue. I just think the you know it's going to continue. Uh, Alabama uh, really a big favorite in this football game. I think we're 28 point favorite in this. Um, I'd go ahead and take Alabama in this football game. I think the defense is going to play better. I think they've had to come to Jesus there one time uh, this week in practice. Is what I've been reading and. Uh, you know, seeing in the headlines there. So I, I expect our defense to come out and play better. Uh, will we keep them under 31 points? Uh, I sure in the hell hope so. Uh, you know, will we score 65 points this week? I don't care. Uh, just want to score more than the other team, baby, and look good doing it. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you know, uh, Damian Harris having a great year. Uh, Najee Harris is having a great year. He's leading the, he's leading the team in rushing right now. Uh, I think the running game is going to be a big part of this football game. Uh, you know, trying to keep our keep our uh, D line fresh and our linebackers fresh and you know, our front seven. But other than that, man, uh, you know, Missouri they got a, they got a decent little running back on Roundtree. He runs the ball hard. Uh, they do got a veteran uh, offensive line, so I'm looking to see how we act in the trenches, baby. How we going to bow up and punch these boys in the mouth for four quarters? And it's going to be a four quarter football game. It's always going to be a four-quarter football game when Alabama's on the football field. And that's the standard. And the standard's going to be back. I'm looking forward to it. Shout out to Alabama Nation. Let's go get this win and uh, show everybody <laughs> that Alabama ain't going nowhere, especially on the defense side of football. Uh, one game don't, doesn't uh, tarnish anything this team's going to do. We're just going to step up, punch these boys in the mouth, put Drew Locke, let him run for his damn life. He's going to be up there with his damn mama by halftime. I'm looking forward to it. Truman smells like cat piss. I don't know why. Missouri, you're even in here. I think just get a team in here that Kentucky could beat. Uh, you know, and uh, maybe Vanderbilt <laughs> on a uh, regular basis. But other than that, there ain't no reason y'all should even be in the damn SEC. Uh, you won't get any respect from any of these SEC fans until you win an SEC championship. Not an SEC's championship. And that's just a fact. Uh, so y'all got a long ways to go before y'all start getting, you know, putting them patches on your chest saying SEC, SEC. It's a standard in this league, and there's a standard in Alabama, and y'all gonna fix, fix and see this standard. So with that being said, there's only one thing for me to say from down here. And that's roll time roll. One time. Up in this bitch, baby. Woo! Oh yeah. Watch out, bull goats. Watch out. Y'all have a good one. Peace, everybody.